So Jake, what are we doing tonight? We're trying to shoot uh, at least a big chunk of the music video uh, in here tomorrow. So we're gonna kinda get some ideas together and then block everything out. Hey guys, before we get started, I do wanna say this video is sponsored by Turo. Turo is a really, really cool app that allows you to share cars. You can go and get pretty much any car imaginable instantly via this app. Use my link! really handy to me because when we go out of town to different places like we are in this video all I've got to do is get on this app and instantly I can search through tons and tons of cool cars pick out which one that I want and immediately book that car so that I have a car for the week to be able to make videos with um, and also so we just have a car for transportation as you guys remember a few weeks ago Turo sponsored our trip to LA which was fantastic and it could not have been any better because we got to get the Lamborghini Huracan and also the Bentley Ventega uh, never would I have thought that I would have had the opportunity to be able to drive either of those vehicles if it was not for this app so again guys if you're going out of town or if you even just live wherever you live and you just want to go drive something really cool or if you just need a normal car for a day go download the app now a really cool part about it is that you're gonna be dealing with normal people again like I said not a rental car company you're dealing with people that are on the app lending their cars out to other people so <laughs> go use the link in the description down below and save $15 off your first trip Daniel we're off Y'all be safe. What you doing? I'm editing. He does the real work around here. Yeah. We don't know what we do. I make the money while you guys go play. Now go have a good time. <laughs> Damn. Y'all be, right, y'all be safe. Okay. Don't, yeah. don't get. When he's editing this, he's telling me Don't get. <laughs> yeah. Don't get shot. Have a good time. Oh, we got changed up. We're about to go take some pictures and sightsee for the music video shoot tomorrow. That's about it. I don't. I don't really know. Let's do this. Oh, look at Daddy Nick. Look at him. Look. Daddy, do people get shot here? Yes, they do, son. Quite often. Where at? Everywhere. Nice. Let's go in here. I need this. All right, I'll get it for you right now. You will? Yep. Thanks, Dad. What, what flavor is good? Uh, try this peach nectar. Are you going to split it with me? Yeah, if you don't like it, I'll drink it. Okay, cool. Sounds good. Hello, a GT3, bro. Eating at the Fellini bar and restaurant. For real, bro. Yes, for please. real, bro. Yes, please. Who's out here in Chicago flexing like that, bro? Please proceed into the lot. We're going to a children's museum right now. We're already past that. No, it's literally right above it. That's where we're going. Past the children's museum. Bro, we're going to we're going to look at the Ferris wheel at the Children's Museum. You know I know how to finesse it in a Honda, right? Oh yeah, flexing in the Honda. Hey Alexa, hey Alexa. How can many just can we fit into a Honda? Uh, uh, yeah, let's go that way. Huh? We getting on this thing? We getting on this thing, bro. Here we go, here we go. Open up, open up. Please be warm. Oh whoa, 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 whoa! Chill out, chill out. Whoa, what the fuck are they doing? Oh, whoa. that's real cold. Whoa, is it cold? Dude, are you? Why would you do this? Do they have Thanks, dude. It is so nice up here. It looks great. It really does. But the one flaw that they had in the whole design, they got the AC on and this thing blowing full. Look at the view, though, dude. This is dope. Oh my god. Wow. How, somehow the camera, for once, does the view justice. Hey, what if the doors? Dude, right why? Now? Why? What? Just why? We were so excited waiting in the line. We waited like 15 minutes in the line. It's cold as shit. The wind's like, blowing. We were like, oh, I bet they don't even have heaters. And then we were like, well, at least there's no wind. <laughs> Come on, man. We go around three. We go around. Come on, man. man. Where's the heater? Come we're on. trying to get off is this. Is it thing. this bitch? Is it this? I already tried that. Where did we just end up at? I don't know what to do. Look all around us. Oh, yeah, this is Look cool. Look at this place. Look at we this place. Found it. We have found a place that has some things. There's not Let's much. Let's go buy some coffee. There's not much things here, but they've got some. We should get Daniel this one right here. This is the boss. Yeah, I'm sure it would make him feel real special, Nate. You know what? I think it's worth it because he's a real tool sometimes. <laughs> There's a Daniel one. Oh, should we get it for him? Danny. Danny. Dick hey, Daniel, Daniel. Future you. Would you rather have one that says Daniel, the boss, Dan, or Danny? Or perhaps Danielle. Or Danielle. <laughs> what if we get him that way? Hey, one? fun fact, Daniel's last name is Lejeune. So whenever Daniel types out his email or something, it's Daniel Lejeune. But it looks like Danielle Lejeune. Oh, we gotta get him the one that says Danielle. Because it'll be so nice, he won't be able to throw it away. Danielle. <laughs> Perfect. I can't wait to see his face. Oh. <laughs> so I was looking through uh, the stuff in the souvenir shop for a gift for Daniel, and then I found these little 18 wheelers. This one by far is my favorite, so I'm gonna get this for him. It's a long story, please don't ask. <laughs> Can I see your ID? My ID? Mm -hmm. To buy this? Yeah, it's just because the tourist spot. It's for Daniel. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> what the? It was $15. <laughs> 
Oh my god. We literally ran like halfway across Chicago to meet you. I'm so happy, Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> so just... Me and my buddy drove five hours to meet you guys. Hey. Oh, I'm literally I'm buying a Z because I watched your videos. Problems. Congrats, bro. You get to hop in the van. Hey, if it makes you feel any better, nobody else has seen this car yet. That's true. <laughs> I feel like y'all are the only ones that have ever had the chance to ride with us in a van. I know. <laughs> So these dudes are really cool. We don't do this with everybody. And they parked like four blocks down, five blocks down at the Hard Rock Cafe and then literally sprinted here. <laughs> so how far did y'all drive, you said? Five, five hours. hours. Five. Take it right. Holy shit. Oh, fuck That's it. crazy. Y'all ran a mile to get here. What the actual? Homies, y'all ran over a mile? Yeah. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. They were Forrest Gumpin' out here to come meet us. Know about it. We will answer now. And we're riding around in the car with them right now. <laughs> There's one. What's up, mom? There, 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 there. He's FaceTiming his mom. Hey. Hey, what's your mom's name? Oh, Michelle. Hi there. Hi, hey, Michelle. Michelle. <laughs> Hello. They proved you wrong. Their mom told them that they were dumb for driving five hours to come because there was a really low chance of them actually meeting us. And now they're in our car. <laughs> they're FaceTiming. Nope. She goes straight home. It's a real awful time to get live. What is? It's Rainforest Cafe, bro. <laughs> Like awful. <laughs> really? Terrible. I pull up at the club, B I P gas tank on Eva, all drinks on me, wipe it out. Oh, here it is. Tyler. Oh, we're picking yeah. up Daniel. These dudes in this car right here apparently drove 10 hours. Where did y'all drive from? Uh, just south of St. Cloud, Minnesota. Yeah. How are y'all? Oh, I'm 17. Okay. I thought you said, how are you? Man, 18. your parents let you drive that far? Yeah. Your parents just let y'all drive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank y'all for coming out, man. Yeah. Yeah, I appreciate it. If you guys say that we do not treat fans good, we do some stuff with some fans sometimes, dude. I've pulled over on the side of the interstate. <laughs> I've waited in the freezing cold for fans instead of fans waiting in the freezing cold for me. We give people rides. I mean, we could probably die from it eventually, but eventually. it's worth me and Jake, me and Jake, let me, look, these people drove four hours to come and see us in North Carolina one time, and they didn't have anywhere to go. So me and Jake uh, let them, there was like six, six people, and it was just me and Jake up there. I still talk to them. We let like six people stay with us, and yeah, we actually still talk to them all the time. We do a lot of crazy stuff like that. A lot of people chastise us, and they're like, you can't do that. You don't know these people. I'm like, I don't care, dude. Yeah, if they support me, they're tell, family. You can tell a good person behind yeah. somebody. That yeah, you can definitely tell a good person or not. Anyway, so I'm glad that we're back in the car. Let's continue this. I don't even know what we're doing tonight. We're continuing something. He said a porca quiero que. He said what? Either that. Does he want us to pay We're now or? Nice. He is. <laughs> is he using my horn? <laughs> yeah, he's All like. Right. Oh, tell me one of them little walnut things. Good? Wow. No, like seriously. Incredible. Nick brought up a very valid point. He said even if we were fifty million dollars rich, I don't think we could eat this. any of this. Shit. That's serious. I'm sorry to say that. But I just feel like Chick Fil A is going to be still in the top three yeah, choices. I'm gonna be real. I'll probably just buy really expensive steaks and really expensive burgers. Honestly, that sounds I'd, I'd amazing. Still, I would still watch a cage and not supposed to have money. Yeah. <laughs> I think the consensus is no expensive food anymore. It's just not worth it. This is how much I enjoyed being what the with. What is going on? What the f is this? What is this? I, w I don't know. I don't even want to look at it. I don't know what this is. What? This is a toy truck. <laughs> it's from That's forever. the only souvenir what that I found that you would really love. Alright, in that case, I'll give you mine. Because I love you and I miss you. And I just want you to know how much you mean to me. Danielle. Will you, <laughs> will you marry me? <laughs> Keep leaving. <laughs> Come back! You know, come step back. On this loaded diaper. <laughs> come I'm back. gonna go upstairs and play with my new truck. <laughs> yeah! You're the best girlfriend a guy could ever ask for. Daniel was literally just not talking about it. I was like, dude, I'm so glad that we came and got you to come hang out with us. He's like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> she just breaks it. <laughs> Damn, <bro>. <laughs> <laughs> What dude, you doing? This is the cool part. You just wanted the truck. Damn, okay. yeah, yo. Is that his bonus? Hey, actually, with Nick's new oh. toy that he got me, I can take this toy apart and play with it. What? Hey Nick, where are we going, dude? Going to Happy Camper, mate. Don't it look like a nicer Bourbon Street? I would say that Chicago that is marginally a nicer New Orleans, but only marginal. <laughs> Good. 
Bro, what? Yeah, that's why I the clock. You just like gonna kick it or what? I was gonna end the verse and just like at the end where I start going into like, I'm gonna take a time bomb live and I'm just like get off and just start well, who's gonna, smashing the clock. Who's gonna clean it up? I'll clean it up. Not expecting that to break. Look, Daniel was in the living room and he was coming to video like some behind the scenes for a snapshot of what we were doing. And he just walks around the corner and as soon as he walks around the corner, I just kick the fuck. Man, I'm trying to get dressed for this music. Oh, now video, you put me. Bro. bro, I don't want to. Bro, I'm looking around, walking around looking like a Sims character, dog. I don't want to. Yeah, take him off. It was wild. I was just saying how this bathtub is shaped like a coffin. Oh god. Oh, oh god. god. Ass down. <laughs> Slide your ass down. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Caleb. I know this is not fun. Gavin gets to kick a clock. <laughs> he gets to drown. I'm sorry, but the hot water's all gone. I don't want that. Oh, we're looking I great. I don't want that. I'm what is that? What is that? It's a butt fuss. Can you open your eyes? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, let's get that shot at least. That won't be bad of him just peacefully underwater in the red light. Ugh. Stay underwater for as long as you can without drowning. I just like, do I need to do anything else? Nope. I don't just need stay to underwater. Move this is my, my mouth, mouth or anything. <laughs> give us a split second under. Give us a whole second. So underwater. what you want me to go down there, open my eyes, and just come up slow? Don't come up. Just hold them open underwater. Okay, that looks creepy as shit, dude. Ow! That was that awesome. Was... You look like you're in a film room. And just and try to relax so that you look like you're natural. Yeah. I hope it. Crazy thoughts that stay on my mind. Nice. Nice. That one wasn't broken. You look very. I feel like we're baptizing Caleb. <laughs> <laughs> He's not having it. Open. Open. Have you ever been so gone? Yes. Have you ever felt so strong? Yeah. yeah. That was good. Open. Only a guy who was just like you sitting here in his room. Oh, I have to. I don't want to do it, but you sit there as a pastor. I can't hear you. Crazy thoughts that stay on my mind. He needs to come in more. Can't keep a pet snake one day. You'll get out of his cage and run away like the last one. This was never started for the money or the fame or the chance for my name. It was just an escape where I could ride all over sinister thoughts. I put my head incorporated in the songs to try to keep myself safe. But nobody want to see the bigger picture. All I focused on is how I'm having money coming quicker every day. The population drifts away from the scriptures. Here's a kicker. I don't think the world will ever see fish. It's rare to see a person take a risk in their life and work for what they want instead of working nine to fives. Because it's harder in the fear. I will they ever survive without a check for someone else's bank to keep them alive?